impotent. Megan having bash pretend has moved on but actually going non-linear, royal cut dead. Meghan Markle, 40, took part in a prank during which Ellen DeGeneres told her to carry out embarrassing tasks in front of unsuspecting vendors. The Duchess, who was wearing a hidden earpiece, was encouraged by the chat show host to eat a tortilla crisp like a chipmunk, refer to herself as mummy, tell jokes and hold a crystal up to her face. Royal commentators Rachel Bowie and Roberta Fiorito branded Meghan's prank as cringe on the podcast Royally Obsessed. Ms. Bowie said, Obviously this is a person who has serious FS to give about anything. I feel like she knows what she's doing in a way that is kind of rubbing the tabloid's face in the mud about this. She knows they are going to latch on to anything she does. To me, this is a person who is really feeling free about who they are but it's also so uncomfortable. Ms. Fiorito added, I immediately compare this to Harry going on James Corden's show pre-Oprah. When Harry had those comedian parts, it felt like a spoof of his old life. He was showing off his military expertise, he was sipping high tea on a double-decker bus, it was an homage to his royal roots. But with Meghan on Ellen, there were no royal references made. I felt that was a choice, Meghan is moving on from that and she doesn't have to be serious. The Duchess of Sussex also spoke of the difficulties of having two children as she shared more intimate details about them. In her televised interview with Ellen DeGeneres, Meghan told of how Archie loves being a big brother to his baby sister Lily. After sharing a picture of the two-year-old feeding chickens while wearing yellow wellies in their home in Montecito, California, Meghan said Archie loves to dance. She also revealed that he dressed as a dinosaur for Halloween, while Lily was a little skunk-like flower from Bambi. The former actress' high-profile appearance comes eight months after the Sussex's controversial sit-down with Oprah Winfrey which left the royal family in crisis. Meghan and Harry have until now remained private about Lily, who was born in June and was named Lilibet after the royal family's nickname for the Queen. They are yet to share a photo publicly of their daughter. The Duchess told chat show host Helen DeGeneres that someone told H, Harry, and I that when you have one kid it's a hobby, and two children is parenting. Suddenly we realized, oh right, everyone talks about what it's like for the second child but no one talks about the adjustment for the first child when the second one comes along. I think they have that moment of, oh, this is fun, oh, this is how it is now. Recently, from doing random squats in public to being addressed as mommy, Megan truly gave street vendors a prank they will never forget. Throughout the prank, Megan was instructed by Ellen through an earpiece to mimic cringeworthy lines to the vendors, which is of course, was something she'd never say or do otherwise. In true Ellen's fashion, her pranks would include a quirky name, followed by strange actions and not forgetting weird questions that would generally make people roll their eyes. Throughout the prank, Megan was accompanied by one of the show's writers, who Melon ridiculously names Puama to play the role executive assistant to Megan, the Duchess of Sussex. She and Megan stopped by three vendors who were selling crystals, hot sauces, and cookies. Megan's rib tickling performance was so realistic till it was hard to differentiate whether it was a prank or not. Megan proved herself yet again that she's one capable woman who truly believes in herself. Her saying things like I have healing powers. Can you feel my powers? Mommy needs some milk and ending the prank with a clueless joke why did the elephant put his trunk in the cookie jar?
she shared more intimate details about them. In her televised interview with Ellen DeGeneres, Meghan told of how Archie loves being a big brother to his baby sister Lily. After sharing a picture of the two-year-old feeding chickens while wearing yellow wellies in their home in Montecito, California, Meghan said Archie loves to dance. She also revealed that he dressed as a dinosaur for Halloween, while Lily was a little skunk-like flower from Bambi. The former actress' high-profile appearance comes eight months after the Sussex's controversial sit-down with Oprah Winfrey which left the royal family in crisis. Meghan and Harry have until now remained private about Lily who was born in June and was named Lilibet after the royal family's nickname for the Queen. They are yet to share a photo publicly of their daughter. The Duchess told chat show host Helen DeGeneres that someone told H. Harry, and I that when you have one kid it's a hobby, and two ch 